Hello, ladies, gentlemen, men, women, guys, gals, them, they, who? No, he's on first base. Ha 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 ha. It's uh, old Rand here with the PPW 477 Friday Frenzy Results. And tonight we introduced an amazing concept match, man. The triathlon matches, and there were two of them. Here's how the match goes. There are three 10-minute falls. The first 10 minutes is how many times can you eliminate your opponent or one of your opponents over the top rope to the floor. The one with the most eliminations after 10 minutes wins the first fall. Then it gets really interesting. There's two-minute rest period. The second fall is 10 minutes, and the man with the most eliminations at the end of second minutes is the winner of the second fall. Two minutes, rinse and repeat, get it? And then here comes the third fall, which is the man with the most pinfalls, and oh my God, I'm with Rockstar Rosie, who's out with a broken ear. And what the hell did you think of this shit tonight, man? Oh, it was a blast to watch tonight. This new concept was a ton of fun. Uh, we had two of them tonight. Mm. The first one was singles triathlon match between Brandon, badass Brandon Campbell, mm. and the Aztec monster Hugh Mech. So quite a fight that they had. Um, in the end, it ended up a stalemate. Um, yeah, yeah. Brandon, Brandon took the final fall with the pinfall. Humek took the first fall with the over-the-top eliminations, and they both had a submission, so it came out an even draw. Unbelievable. I've seen Humek and Brandon do things tonight I've never seen him do before. Mm -hmm. What a great way to inaugurate. Is inaugurate a word? I think so. Yeah, to Good inaugurate word. the PPW triathlon match. Then the next one, man, had some real crazy to it. I'm talking about a three-way tag triathlon matchup. Marcus the Science Smith facing the relentless Jay Leon facing former PPW heavyweight champion El Guerrero Jose Acosta. Same thing applied. You know, like we said with the falls. Jay Leon squeaked by with one extra elimination and won the first fall. The second fall, believe it or not, Marcus the Science, Marcus the King, I'm sorry, I'm glad I, when he hears this, just relax. <laughs> Marcus the King Smith, who can wrestle when he wants to, that's in part why we hate him, got that submission via the Rings of Science. And then the third fall, El Guerrero, former PPW heavyweight champion, won the third and final fall with his patented finish with a little extra on it. You're going to have to see it. And where you can see it is on Rumble. We stream Friday Night Frenzy on Rumble Live. It is up there now, guys. You've got to see it. Now, that being said, here comes the pimp. Don't go nowhere. Hold on to your seats tomorrow night at the building here. Tomorrow night is Saturday the 13th. Uh, yes, it is. Saturday the 13th, the main event, Marcus the King Smith puts up his King of the Iron Man title versus a young, hungry Jesse Danger, who's the current Challenge Pro champion. Then another original PPW concept match. Nine men involved in the Every Man for Himself elimination tag match. Two competitors at a time with the remaining wrestlers with their hand on the middle rope on the floor. And as they tag in, they compete. Non-stop action, and we mean it. Bell time is 7.30. Doors are at 7 if you're within earshot of Woodstock, Illinois, which is Chicago land and also southeast Wisconsin. We're only a stone's throw away. Now, while you're here on YouTube, Please like and subscribe. Go ahead and subscribe to our Rumble. You can help support Premier Pro Wrestling and get cool shit in return via Premier Pro Wrestling, our official merchandise shop on Pro Wrestling Tees. And last but certainly not least, you're going to see exclusive matches like tonight's matches, almost 500 of them, Premier Pro Wrestling on Patreon.